Hey guys, welcome back to Tony Zatu's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use Home Depot gift card online. But before we start, hurry up and check out our digital software just under this video. So let's get started. Let's get, how do you actually use the Home Depot gift card? So in this case, the first thing we need to do here is we first need to make sure that we have an account on Home Depot. In this case, go to homedepot.com and from here at the top right, we have the login option. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now, from here, you could go ahead either choose sign in or register. Now, if you already have an account, you could choose sign in, but if you don't have an account yet, you could choose register. Now, on the registration page, what you need to do is you need to choose the appropriate account. So in this case, if you're just shopping for yourself or per personal use, you could use the personal account section. Now, if you're in business or you're purchasing items from Home Depot for your business, you could choose the Pro Extra account here. But in this case, since I'm using this for myself, I'm going to use the personal account here. Let's go and click on select and continue. Now from here, you just need to enter your email address as well as your password and a phone number that you want to use for your account. In this case, once you click on create an account, you'll be receiving or you'll be asked to enter a one-time passcode, which will be sent to your email address. So as an example, this is what's going to look like. So in this case, just copy the one-time code, enter it in the next page, and you should be able to have your account created, which is something really, really cool and really, really fast. Now, from here, what we need to do next is we need to lock in. Since again, if you create your account, it's going, you're, you're going to be automatically locked in. But again, since I already have my account here, I'm going to sign in. Let's go and click on sign in here. And from here, what we need to do is we need to enter our email address. And from here, let's go and hit on continue. And from here, let's go ahead and enter the verification code, which again, will be sent to your email address. So in this case, let's just wait for it to load up to appear here. Let's go ahead and copy this one. And from here, go back, enter a feature code, click on verify. Now, in this case, for you to start using your Home Depot gift card, we first need to add items into our cart. So in this case, go ahead and start shopping here, start adding items that you wanna buy. So as an example, I actually already added an item on my cart. So again, you could go ahead and search for uh, items or tools that you want to buy here. So for example, I want to say that I'm looking for a drill. So go ahead and search for that end here. And uh, from here, you could go ahead and just add them into a cart. So yeah, so basically just start shopping, start adding items that you want to buy before you'll be able to start uh, buying them. But once you've added them in your cart, like for example, this one, you could go ahead and click on add to cart here. So in this case, it will be added into your cart here. So this might take a while. So item is not eligible for fulfillment. So as you can see, sometimes you get that notification. But again, just start adding your items. But since I already have items in my cart, let's go and choose cart at the top right. And from here, you should be able to see your cart. Now in your cart, you need to choose the items that you want to buy. So we have this one. So in this case, you could go and choose the uh, option. So delivery or pickup. So if it's actually available, you could choose pick up here. Or if you want to choose delivery here, you could go ahead and do that. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to start checking out. Let's go and click on check out. And it should redirect you to another page. Where in this case, you need to fill out the check, uh, the check-in details or check-out details here. That includes your delivery address, your phone number, your first name, your last name, as well as the delivery address aligned to and the zip code. So in this case, you could use the billing address here as well. Or if you have a different billing address, you could go ahead and specify that as well if you, by clicking this one. And you also have the text me updates on the status order. Now, in this case, once you've provided all the details here, so for now, let's go and provide those details. Now, once you hit on continue, it's going to show you the delivery options here. So in this case, it's going to be free for mine, but in this case, you should be able to see the delivery costs in here. So go and click on continue. And from here, you have the payment method. Now, in this case, you could go ahead and enter your credit card here. Like for example, if you want to use credit card or PayPal, you could go ahead and choose either. So you just enter your card number, expiration date, the year, and the CVV, which is on the back of that card. Now, if you have a gift card, you could choose the apply a gift card option or link here at the bottom of the payment method section. And once you click on it, it's going to ask you to enter the gift card number as well as the pin. Now, if you don't know where to actually uh, see it, you could go and click on where do I find this. So in this case, it's going to actually be at the back. So it's going to be labeled as pin. So we'll go ahead and copy the pin, enter it in here. And also you need to confirm that you're not a robot. And once you've entered all the SR details here as well as your gift card details, you can go ahead and click on review your order. And from then on, proceed with the checkout. 
this case, it's actually pretty easy on how to use your Home Depot gift card here. But if you need uh, some uh, details or some questions, if you have any questions on regarding Home Depot's uh, gift cards here, you can actually visit their FAQs here, which is going to be linked under this video. So yeah, you could go ahead and read them about the how it actually works, how it's actually different from uh, plastic gift cards, uh, what are fees associated with it. So any questions that you may come up with is where you'll be able to read them in this section here. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.